Good morning, it's Rachel Carroll from the Neuromuscular Studio. Just wanted to talk a little bit today about trigger points in the pec muscles. It's a very um, important area to make sure that we're working on a regular basis. Sometimes if your shoulders are rounding forward um, and you're feeling pain in the back of your shoulder, uh, your shoulder blade area, it's actually coming from tightness in the pecs. And so um, when the pecs become tight, they pull that and roll that shoulder forward. Um, trigger points in the pec muscle, especially the pec minor, can be very problematic, can cause a burning sensation in the anterior um, shoulder, front shoulder joint, and then down into the bicep. So if you take a look here, this is our trigger point uh, chart for um, trigger points in the pectoralis minor, which is the small muscle um, underneath the big uh, pec major muscle. So pec minor um, runs kind of at a 45 degree angle from um, the ribs, kind of the middle rib area um, to um, the front of the shoulder. And as you can see here, the front um, section of the shoulder is where the large referral area is. And then um, it refers all the way down and then into kind of where the bicep is on the inside of the arm. And this um, travels all the way down into the hand. So if you're having that type of a pain pattern and you feel like it's bicep or it's something from your workout, um, chances are it actually might be um, the pec muscle. So coming in and doing some neuromuscular work um, and getting that pec to release and then supporting all the um, musculature in the shoulder will help you to have less pain. So hopefully that helps and uh, have a great weekend. Bye.